Good morning. We are here in Punta Gorda, Florida, here on the Charlotte Harbor at my parents' new place. As you can see, we got a pool. Yes. Yes. Too bad. It's, today's like the only really warm day. It's going to be like 81. We're going out onto the, out into the, uh, you know, the inner harbor. We're going to see what we catch. It's been kind of rough around here, as uh, many of you know. The red tide definitely affected this area. There was many dolphins, many fish species that died, and they actually had to change some regulations. So we're not gonna be keeping pretty much anything. If we catch enough maybe sea trout, we might keep one or two, but other than that, we're gonna be throwing everything back because this area needs all the fish in its harbors that it needs. So stay tuned. Hopefully we're gonna catch some fish and I'll see you on the water. Yep. I wasn't even looking, it just killed it. <laughs> All right. Oh. You know how much I love salt cats. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's a fish. Oh, it's not coming off. There we go. Ah, oh, you. All right. First blood. I didn't get skunked. Got fish on finally at the new spot. Whoa, what do we got here? We got a snook, all right. Oh, dude, 24 all day, son. Yeah. Getting ready for the tour, 2020. <laughs> it felt like a five pounder. It really did. Nice red. Nice red. Yes. Come here. Come here. The cut and retie. Now that is a nice red. successful day. Caught a couple fish. I got a nice red, a sheepy. Um, these guys in the boat. We got a snook. We got a mangrove. Dad has been an awesome captain today. That was day one. Stay tuned for day two. What's going on guys? I'm on a bike now. The two rods. Get a little leg workout before we do. Hopefully we're going to catch some snook. We're gonna go back to the same spot as yesterday. And uh, yeah, hopefully we're gonna catch some fish. I got right here a whopper plopper, and then a DOA uh, shrimp. I think we're gonna get lucky today. The storm has just passed. It was raining all morning. Uh, I think the fishing will be good no matter what. I mean, still, I'm outside. It's January, 70 degrees. Sounds like a good time to me. 
See you at the spot. All these fish jumping around. And they don't want them. Nothing to do with me, I think. They're all mullets, I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, ho. oh, ho, my God. What the hell is that? Yeah. Yeah. I got a jack. Nice. <laughs> Corale Jack Cabal. Nice. First crack of all, back you go. All right, I'll get another one, shit. They are biting. All those are jacks out there. Another spot. There's always something around these big harbors here. I wanna see if I can get a bigger jack or something. On the bass wheel. <laughs> oh, these are fun. Boom. Oh, let's get another one. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Oh, this is so much fun, guys. Another jack. <laughs> no, that seems to be helping. <laughs> Get on the papa. Some jacks, they're busting all over the harbor, so just using artificials and reeling extremely fast. <laughs> yeah, they croak. Wow. Yeah, they're like. Rawr, rawr, rawr. I know, it's kind of fun. Yeah, they're all in here right now, so if you want to have some fun, this is the time. Oh, it's all right. Cool. Have, have an awesome evening. I gotta catch some more. Huh? Yeah, Jack Creval's. After another here, holy cow. Yes, this is so much fun, guys. Oh, and these things fight just so strong, even though a lot of locals kind of just like, yeah, whatever, we got jacks. But when you catch nothing, 
You gotta have something. Jack, I don't know. Huh? Oh, oh, oh. oh, come on. Come back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Time for another one. This is like speed fishing. There's a big one in here. I want the big one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're one after another. Ugh. There we go. It took too long. I'm starting to get worried. Hey, you got one. Oh, yeah. Supper. Oh, no, this is just, you throw these back. They don't taste good. You caught a fish. Yeah, they're all right here. Yeah? Aren't you going to keep any? No, you don't want to eat these. They're just jacks. They're just fun to catch. All right, Max, we got to go. Can I try? Um, if you want to grab that pole right there, you can. If you have to go, then you have to go. <laughs> no problem, have a good evening. Good morning. Another day in Florida is actually very gloomy. It rained literally like 36 hours in a row. It just kept raining and kept raining. And there's no way I could get out there and do any fish. And then the day before, it was ugh. Um, so today is my last day, full day in Florida. We're going to catch a bunch of fish. We're actually going to go back to Bokelia. And we're going to go to that red spot. That um, I shouldn't say that. I, I call it a red spot because there's always a bunch of reds there. And then um, we're going to go with my buddy Tom. We're going to take that John boat out again. Um, kind of like in my second video that I ever shown. Um, we're going back to that spot because it's a ton of fun. Um, as you can see, my parents live in Punta Gorda now in Burn Shore Marina. Um, so it's always good to have some old friends in the neighborhood back where they used to live so I can fish. Hey, about it. So stick around. Let's get in the ram. This is a 97 ram too. My dad got all like pimped out. Put like the sport thing on there, some new wheels. The 1500. Got a lot has a lot of power. It's in great shape, you know, being up from up, you know, in the rust belt, seeing these cars in this good of shape, even the undercarriage, it's like, oh, wow. So let's take a big old ride in my pick em up truck and let's go catch some fish. It's actually a nice, decent size snapper. I'm not keeping anything today, but it's still fun to catch it. There we go. That's a beautiful fish. Some more keep. Nice. All right. We're on them now, Tom. Woo! She 
We got a friend. He does. Pecking at it. Another one. We're killing the mangroves today. They are hungry. The fish are like warm <laughs> in comparison. Oh, he's, he's, oh, don't do that. Come. There we go. Say bye. Nice. All right. We in the fifth time. We in it. Snapper. Come, come. There you go. You. <laughs> I'm down at the bottom here. Going to back it up. Well, this really sucks. It's time to end the video because I have to go home in the Chicago area. Looking at the coldest day of ever in Chicago, at least while humans were there. Um, so kind of just soaking up the sun right now because it's going to be a few months before it's going to feel this good outside. So thank you so much for watching. We'll have some more videos coming up soon. Later.